We're gearing up for another big week of testimony in the Michael Jackson death trial. Today is day five. Last week, it was all about the people who were there in Michael Jackson's home, also EMT workers, doctors, everyone who encountered Michael Jackson and Conrad Murray on the day Michael Jackson died. But let's talk about this week. I've got in-session correspondent Gene Casares with me. And Gene, let's talk about what we expect this week. Well, you know who we haven't heard from yet are law enforcement. Because law enforcement, they initially, it was a death investigation. It went forward. It suddenly was determined to be a homicide. So I think this week we're going to get into that police investigation, uh, Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department also. But remember, there were a lot of EMTs inside the room of Michael Jackson. We've, we've only heard from two of them. We've heard from one doctor from uh, UCLA Medical Center. So maybe there'll be a little more of that before we get into law enforcement. Okay, all about the prosecution continuing with the timeline, trying to tell the story of what happened to Michael Jackson, and at least according to the prosecution, how Dr. Conrad Murray was responsible.